Welcome to the Sarah Fit Show, the latest healthy living info brought to you by SarahFit.com. Today I'm sharing with you my fall TV preview. And so since this is a fitness and health related channel, I'm mainly going to mention the health and fitness TV shows. So The Biggest Loser is going to debut September 21st and they're going to be doing couples again. This year, they've got some other competition, not in the same time slot, don't worry, you can get both your fixes, but Jackie Warner is back on Bravo with a new series called Thin Intervention. The difference between Thin Intervention and The Biggest Loser is that with Thin Intervention, they're not actually brought onto a ranch. Jackie is working with the clients in their daily lives at the gym, and the website even says she might sabotage them. I probably shouldn't use the word sabotage, but intervene while they're out dining with their friends and other activities to make sure that they're staying on track. One of the cast members of the intervention is actually Gina from the Real Housewives of Orange County. And if you remember, Gina is just an amazing character. She's one of the few characters on reality television that's likable, in my opinion. I loved Gina. I shouldn't say rare, but Gina's great. Um, so I'm really excited for this show. I love Jackie Warner's advice. I love her fitness and health tips. One of her best is that, you know, have two cheat meals a week. Don't have a cheat day, have a cheat meal and have two because one's not enough. This program promises to have some great tips and it's also going to kind of uh, poke at the biggest loser because they're saying that uh, this way is more realistic to lose weight and is more likely for long-term success. Another show you can look forward to in mid-season is on The CW with Sarah Rue, who recently lost weight with Jenny Craig, and she's going to be hosting Shedding It for the Wedding. And this is going to be a little bit bigger, Biggest Loser-esque, where they're going to have contestants losing weight before their wedding. Whichever contestants lose the least amount of weight or whoever voted off, uh, get voted off. So obviously, as you guys know, with The Biggest Loser, it's not always who loses the least, but it's a combination of the two. So I'm really excited for this show with Sarah Rude. They don't have a date yet, but they're saying mid-season. So once a few shows get canceled, this one will get put on the air. And also, the same production company that produces Biggest Loser has been casting since May for a high school weight loss show that I'm assuming is going to be on MTV. No word yet if it's been picked up, if it's even started filming, but I wouldn't be surprised if MTV has a new weight loss show for teens. And I have one last thought to leave you all with. I love The Biggest Loser. Do you guys? My one complaint is that it's two hours long. This is a show that's promoting health and fitness, getting up off the couch, but then they have you sit there in front of the TV for two freaking whole hours. The show does not need to be two hours. So if you're a producer and you're watching this, make The Biggest Loser one hour. It would be much better. I mean, it just doesn't make sense to me. Oh yeah, go out, exercise. You always have time to exercise, fit into your day. But then you're gonna take up two hours of my night by just sitting in front of the TV. I TiVo it and then I watch it the next day, you can cut out about at least 40 minutes. Um, so I highly suggest that to everybody at home if you're a Biggest Loser fan. And if you work for The Biggest Loser, why not cut it down to an hour? I know it's money, but come on, are you guys really looking out for our health or your wallet? So hopefully you enjoyed this video. If you have any TV shows that I missed, please leave them down below in the comments. And what do you think about this loser? about the biggest loser, this loser, yeah, me. Uh, what do you think about the biggest loser? Are you excited for the intervention and shedding it for the wedding? And if you have any suggestions for some weight loss shows that you'd like to see, also leave those in the comments below. You can follow me on Twitter, Diet Sarah. Subscribe to my channel right here on YouTube. Click the subscribe button up above. You know where it is. And as always, visit my blog, sarahfit.com. I will see you guys real soon.